Greg Ruff along with you in the postgame. Chad Hibden gets the win here on homecoming. Just talk about what, what you got out of this game for the most part. Well, it's so important just to get out and compete against another opponent um, to allow our girls uh, to kind of showcase what they've been working on uh, since preseason through this first part of the early season. Uh, obviously, you saw some jitters early. We were doing a lot of nice things, but we were rushing shots and forcing some things. And, and that's it. I mean, I think it's just familiarity. We have so many new faces. So getting out there and seeing what that looks like with them and uh, trying to figure out a little bit of a rotation, mm -hmm. I think, is important. Um, you know, we got a lot of girls battling, uh, you know, for, for some time and minutes and things like that. And so you get them out there and, um, you know, give them that uh, – exam so to speak mm -hmm. and uh, see how they pass the test so yep. we got some highlights we're going to start rolling some of those i just want you to comment on what you see over there well i can't see much for the water bottle greg <laughs> there you go there you go that was pepper for the layup yeah it's just pep being pep, that's, that's pep uh, scoring she's done a great job uh and they're just, just we were in tack mode I, I i think that was the most important thing for us just faith there attacking the basket Olivia Stevens doing exactly what we asked her to do defensively, uh, being a gap, play for deflections. Uh, great anticipation by her. She's doing well lately. Uh, and here Pep just being Pep, drawing, making plays. Uh, she's a playmaker, uh, makes us a lot better when she's doing that. Uh, just, just a lot of different players stepping up, uh, everybody chipping in. Uh, I thought everybody just tremendous, tremendous energy and effort today. You had 12 different people score out there today. You had four in double figures. That's something you're not used to getting, the, the at least last year, really. No, we haven't really had that uh, since we've been here. And, and we literally have, uh, I believe, six to seven uh, that consistently could give us double figures. Now, that's not going to happen every night, yeah. but they have the ability of doing that. Um, and, and, and that's the difference that we are. We, we have, you know, we have more offensive firepower, and what we've got to do is just get more comfortable with one another. And there's another big shot. Just Hit great some execution. threes out there. Yeah, absolutely. We, 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 our three-point percentage, we should be better. Uh, field goal percentage should be better this year. Uh, and it's just, you know, mostly because we're, we're playing together, uh, and, and that's what we've got to keep doing is just continuing to share the ball, execute. That was a – you know, a called set there for execution, and they did it, you know. And so um, the, the nuances of, of being out there and making adjustments and things are so important in a game like this. Um, and, and so you just you see opportunities there where we throw it inside and get a kick out. Those are things that we do in practice. We drill it, we teach it, uh, and it's great to see them execute that in the game. You got a couple of days off before you go to – UConn. Yeah. And then you come back home for a big – so this is a big week coming up. Man, from Saturday to Saturday is a huge week for us. We're asking a lot out of our, our, our student athletes and our players, um, but it builds toughness, you know, to, to play a game today and then jump on a flight tomorrow heading out uh, to go play UConn. And, um, you know, obviously what a storied program they have. And yep. It's going to be an unbelievable challenge. But, once again, it's a great opportunity for our young women to, to step up and, and, and see who's ready. Uh, and then we come back, get a, get, get a little bit of rest and a, and a day to tune up for uh, two big games Friday and Saturday. Uh, we, we need a, a gym atmosphere like this on Friday and Saturday. Great event, men and women's pops dunking, four games each day, uh, fun-filled day full of basketball. Absolutely. See, we got you sitting, so I look a little closer to your height. <laughs> great win. Have a great week. We'll keep everybody up to date on what happens at UConn and then get everybody ready to come back here Friday and Saturday for the Pop Stunkin. Hey, I want to say something. Thank you for you and Andrew and DK and everybody else. You guys have done an awesome job getting this stuff ready. I know it ain't easy. You know you guys don't get praised enough, but thank you for what you do now allowing us to showcase our teams. Well, I'll add everybody out in the pool. Absolutely. And I, know the a, I know there's a ton of them. So thank you, everybody. Thank you for noticing. Appreciate yep, it. Appreciate it. Back with men's basketball right after this.